In this tutorial, we'll show you how to fix the blue screen of death stop error 0x24. The error 0x24 occurs when there's some problem in the system hard drive or in the partition where Windows is installed. The error screen will splash while booting up Windows. In order to resolve this error, restart the computer with the F8 key pressed in order to access the advanced boot options. From there, select the option Safe Mode with Command Prompt and hit the Enter key. Once you're done, the system will boot up, and after a few minutes, the command prompt will appear. Type the command chkdsk c colon slash f slash r and hit enter. This command is used to check the errors in the hard drive. C is the partition where Windows is installed, slash f switch is used to fix the error, while the slash r switch is used to repair the error. You'll be informed that the system volume is being used by another process, and it cannot run. Would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time the system restarts? Here type Y and hit the Enter key. Now type the command shutdown-r-t0 and hit Enter. This command is used to restart the system, while the dash T switch is used for the time, and the numeric 0 is used to specify the time in which the computer will shut down. With that done, the system will restart, and the disk check wizard will start. It will check the five stages of the disk. The first is file verification. The second stage is of verifying the indexes. The third stage is of verifying the security descriptors. In the fourth stage, it will check USN journal verification, followed by the fifth stage in which we'll verify the file data. Once the process has been completed, it will automatically fix and repair the error and the system will restart. As a result, the system will boot up in the normal condition, and in this way, you have successfully resolved the error 0x24.